It is safe to assume that the majority of people who play Rollercoaster Tycoon have done so for the prospect of theme park management. The challenge of making a popular and financially beneficial park is one of the key elements of the game. However, there are select groups who take these practices to higher levels. Through the creation of compact roller coasters and high rates of passengers per hour, min-maxing in Roller Coaster Tycoon is an art form. But for the moment, let's not talk about passengers per hour, but more so passengers per train. Which roller coaster can have the most passengers on a single train? For this experiment, we are only looking at one train. There are many more factors that need to be considered before we look into multiple trains for capacity. These include train length, car length, station length, and other solutions such as block sections. So for the moment, we have set up a single train to its maximum length in Vanilla Roller Coaster Tycoon. To be considered in this experiment, the coaster type must have an option for more trains as well as more cars per train. This unfortunately eliminates coasters such as Wild Mouse and Inverted Hairpin Coasters and other predetermined small coaster cars. This leaves us with a selection of wooden tracked coasters, steel and inverted. For data purposes, we'll find the highest in each category. Some of these coaster trains actually have a few interesting factors. The Mine Ride and the Mine Coaster Train have a train engine for aesthetical purposes. This means in calculating the final totals of these trains, we remove one car and add 0.5 of a car, due to the fact that two peeps can still ride in the front. As well as this, certain cars can hold up to six guests, which I believe is an advantage in this experiment. In the steel category, the highest count was 42 from seven cars on the Hypercoaster. However, surprisingly, this was followed by the Mine Ride with 38 from 9.5 cars. Tailing them was the Hypercoaster 4 wide cars and Giga Coaster, both with 36 from 9 cars. In the Inverted category, the Inverted Coaster led the way with 36 from 9, followed by most of the other Inverted Coasters with 28 from 7. The Compact Inverted Coaster, however, got 16 from 8, becoming joint last with the Air Powered Coaster from all of the others in the experiment. Meanwhile, in the wooden coaster category, the range was a lot smaller. The highest was wooden mine train coasters, with 26 from 6.5 cars. And funnily enough, the wooden coaster, the six-seater and the articulated coasters all yielded 24 guests per train at their longest lengths. So in conclusion, hypercoasters have the most guests per train in vanilla roller coaster tycoon. Inverted coasters nearly all have the same riders per train, bar a few exceptions. Now go mod the game and have fun putting a monorail on a hypercoaster.